Another day back at the house. Today, we started off by cementing this. So we built a wooden mold as such and filled it full of concrete because this all collapsed and then the grids go back on but the grids just fell through because it was weak cement here so properly cemented that now so it should be okay and then we're going to tackle the roofs we're going to put metal borders on it for the wind <laughs> Now you struggle. What is that? Look at this bad boy. So, on another episode of Let's Pretend What the Hell I'm Doing. Let's pretend I know what the hell I'm doing. Just removing some door frames. Yeah. So, started off by taking these borders off. Then cutting through and cutting through the wood here and then just hammering them through and using the crowbar so that it's taken off with the least amount of damage. Needed to get these off, not only because we're changing the doors but because obviously these metal frames are in here that we need to get out because we need to remove all this hallway tiling. And it does look like it does go deeper than this level here. So, but still, it's going to be cheaper to raise this rather than raise all the other rooms. So, makes the most amount of sense. <laughs> Without nails, yeah. Croatian, lazy, yeah. lazy Croatians. This is uh, normal practice. This first was stayed outside, yeah, but with the wind go, yeah? Yeah. Then this nailing, yeah? Uh -huh. How about this other is. What's that? No, this is uh, beard. Uh. Shaved beard. Screwing them down. So we've got two different types of tiles. We've got these new ones, which are a bit bigger. What? We've got the older ones, just on video. And just the old ones on this roof here. Just got to repair that kind of side and make sure the ridges are all secure. But on here, just making sure they're all the problematic ones anyway, screwed down. So as you can see, we started putting up one side of the house. And we're going to start on this side, bring it all together and do the central top part at the end. But yeah, it's looking good, isn't it? good so how we put this on is that we just drill three holes and then put a raw plug in and then just screw it in with these special screws and they've got so using a, a six mil drill and we've got these screws with washers on here and just six mil six mil Raw plugs. So yeah, it's gonna look good. And that'll stop the uh, tiles from flying around. Super. Actually, mean. 
Давай. Лайк. Let's go, 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 yeah. Hey, so that's the roof pretty much done. Um, the only defect is this little bit going up a bit higher, but can't do anything about that because the root the tiles are like sticking up a bit so I'll have to do but paint it brown no one will notice but yeah good bit of work the problem's going to be on the other side of the house because it's such a quite tall house it's like six meters high so at least so yeah we haven't really got the right equipment because our ladder doesn't stretch that far and our scaffold might just about reach it but it's a bit sketchy so we'll see anyway that's what we're going to tackle tomorrow i managed to also take out all the doors this one kind of pushed up a bit the rest out reasonably well but there just went wrong somehow but yeah found the best way to just get a circular saw and just cut the wood and just chisel it out but yeah I'm gonna crack onto that floor there as a way to start and here as well I thought I'd just have a little bit of a go at it just to have a look but yeah all good getting tired now my babe's over there, he, uh, tucking into her noodles. One sorry, please. <laughs> <laughs> Loving life. Oh, wow, it's burning. Oh. <laughs> Mama's burning something. Yeah, best to leave me out of this. Audrey's got the best seat in the house. She's been sleeping in here for a couple hours. Now she's having a lollipop, living her best life. Looking good, looking good. Cutting the bushes on the border. The border of the house goes kind of like straight from there, so cleaning out all the bushes from here and it was all filled with stuff. This stuff is really hard to get rid of as well because it's just so spiky. See how tough it is. With some grass, the neighbours' bushes are all gone. And in the fire. Well, that was a massive fire before, but now it's not so big. But yeah, that's all done. Also made use of this trunk. Look how pretty this is, eh? Nice flower in there. All wood chopped up. Nice sizes and stacked neatly. Take these back home. Burn nice in the stove. Tomorrow is going to be really rainy, like eight hours of rain and really strong gusts, apparently around 60 kilometers an hour. So have to get this door closed up. So make sure that none of the roof tiles get, un get unlodged. So yeah, let's do all the uh, water activities today. Here's our makeshift door. Well, off. Still got a lot to do on it, but. I'll do the trick for today. Call me door fitter Joe. That's breaking up the hole. We spoke about the levels. All these old quarry tiles. 
Got this massive breaker. And underneath the floor we found an old pipe. Good job we didn't get that hit. Steel pipe work, probably cold. Dad came up with a suggestion to run the new hot and colds down here potentially, but we'll uh, think about that. Drive because we're going to get another container skip. <laughs> 